Hi, I'm Ken Moore. I'm going to show you a few tips on how to hack your Wiimote. Now the first thing you need to learn is how to connect your Wiimote to your computer with Bluetooth. You can find these steps elsewhere on the web, but I have a few pointers that will save you some time. And notice, I'm using Windows Vista. Other operating systems will have slightly different steps. The first thing you want to do is open your control panel and open the Bluetooth devices panel. Now, on the Devices tab, click the Add button at the bottom. This will bring up the Add Bluetooth Device Wizard. Click the checkbox that says, My device is set up and ready to be found. Now, before clicking Next, you'll need to press 1 and 2 simultaneously on your Wiimote. This puts the Wiimote into Bluetooth connection mode, and you'll see the blue lights blinking at the bottom. Now you can click Next. After a moment, the wizard should locate a device named Nintendo RVL CNT01. That's your Wiimote. Select the device and click Next. The next screen asks about setting up a Bluetooth passkey, which we don't need. So select the fourth option, don't use a passkey. By this time, your Wiimote has probably stopped searching for a connection. The blinking only lasts about 20 seconds. So once again, press 1 and 2 to reactivate the connection mode, and click Next. That's it. If all has gone well, you'll see this success dialog. Now you can click Finish and know that your Wiimote and your computer are connected. Note that once you've made the connection, the Nintendo device will remain in your Bluetooth devices list. However, if the connection is broken by turning off your Wiimote or shutting your computer down, you'll need to restore it by running through these same steps once again. And that may seem like a pain, but after a couple of times it just becomes habit. Now that the Wiimote is connected, let's make sure it's working. I like to use this Wii Data Visualizer written by Matthias Shapiro. It shows the states of all of the buttons and the accelerometers. You can even toggle on the blue lights at the bottom of your Wiimote and activate the rumble feedback. Looks like we're in good shape. Good luck to you and happy hacking.